Good afternoon everybody and welcome to the SMH Group Stadium for this afternoon's Van Rover National League action. It's League Leaders Chesterfield against 13th place Rochdale. Demani Mello with the header. Oh, it goes over the top of Grimes and a great chance here. Good stop by Tyra. Great stop there by Harry Tyra from uh, number 10, Devante, Devante Rodney. Grimes out to Horton on the left hand side. A short ball in there to Dobra, but possession lost again. Keen Hayes with a chance here. Hayes trying to go all the way. There's a good tackle in the end, and the shot comes in. And again, saved by Harry Sider. Dobra makes the run short towards the front of the six yard box. The ball goes all the way through. It's Grimey's header. And the header downwards. It was off target, and nobody else could intercept it on the way into the net. Long ball for that's a good ball from Nevis as well. Williams couldn't get to it. Cairo Mitchell did. And it is a one-handed save by Harry Tyler there. Mitchell tried to chip the goalkeeper. And Harry Tyler makes yet another save. Old Acre fires one in. It comes off the head of the defender. Sheckler to Mandeville who crosses back in once more. And the header on target from Grigg but lacking any real power and Tiernan Brooks making a comfortable save Nevitt everybody pressing here for Rochdale the ball in from Armstrong Mitchell couldn't get a purchase on it there and eventually Cairo Mitchell puts it wide goal kick so is this one going to be Banks no, it's Oldacre again, fires it in and it's a good save. A great save there by Tien and Brooks, the Rochdale goalkeeper. Mandeville with the flag kick on the far side. Nevert with the header away. Horton with the ball back in again, it comes up, Ebanks break! And he's got on the line! Came, uh, e Banks Landell rather it came off and I'm not quite sure if that's going to go down as an own goal or Jamie Grimes' goal whether Grimes got a touch at the back post we couldn't quite see well Tom Naylor is the man credited with the goal he's got in at the back post then it came up off uh, Ebanks Landell but uh, just a couple of minutes into the second half, the Spirites have the lead. Tom Naylor is credited with the goal. Chesterville 1, Rochdale 0. Joined by Grimes, is, Grimes is there as well. The ball in is near post. It comes off the defender last. It's Mallow that tries to get the ball away. Comes out to Shackleford. Everybody in the Rochdale half part tighter. Banks. Banks with the cross this time, and Will Greg slides it home to get goal number 21 of the season, and it's 2-0 to the Spirites. Will Greg, 21 goal this season now. Oli Banks with a great cross into the box on the right-hand side. There are two of them there. Grigg, of course, was there first. That's how you get your goals. And it's Chesterfield 2, Rochdale 0. East again. Gordon. East with the through ball, and onto it there is Cairo Mitchell. It's another save from Tyra, but he can't keep the ball out from Demani Mella. Demani Mella, the Rochdale goal scorer. And Rochdale are back in, he's at 2-1. Oldacre, Shackleford, Williams to Grimes. Dobra got between two there. That's a good ball as well for Naylor, there's no flag on the linesman. Griggs in there! And Will, oh, and Will Grigg puts the ball in the back of the net and the linesman's flag goes up.
great ball through there from Dobra. Mandeville out wide to Banks first time ball in from Banks Griggs in there the header away by the defender and five back in and wide Romley and Mandeville and he's uh, it's a like for like substitution he's gone to play on that left hand side where Damani Mello was playing and Rochdale getting forward now as East plays it through to uh, Sinclair who gets his first shot to the ball played in again and a chance here for Rochdale and the shot from Rodney, and he's in the back of the net from Devante Rodney. And suddenly Rochdale are level at 2 2. Well, Liam Manneville stands over the free kick. Played in towards Horton at the back. It comes to Grimes, it comes to Williams, it comes to Dobra, and Dobra curls one wide. Again, another opportunity there to win the game. So Brooks will take the free kick, or the goal kick. And the final whistle from Andrew Miller, the referee at the SMH Group Stadium this afternoon. Sees it finish all square.